Greetings and welcome back to our CK2 Shattered Realms playthrough where it's no longer shattered. We are the Kingdom of Westeros. So a uh, quick apology for last video that I uh, had no audio. I thought I had that working. I guess I did not. So sorry about that. And we are at war with the King Beyond the Wall. Uh, another quick thing. There was actually a bug that happened when I was ending last video that uh, glitched. So we lost, I think, a couple, a month or two. Not much. But we no longer have Lightbringer. So I'm going to have to uh, do the event again. So basically what I was saying was when we became uh, the Chosen of Rolar, we should have gotten Lightbringer, right? That's supposed to happen. But since we didn't, and I don't know why, I had to uh, use the event to actually activate that. So we're going to uh, just do that now. Just so we have, I think it's not it's not as good as our uh, Valerian Steel Sword, but, you know, thematically appropriate, I guess, right? Uh, event, Red Priest 5? Oh, no, that's not it. Uh... All right, give me a second. Uh, you know what? I couldn't remember what the uh, event is, so we'll just ignore that for now. So in the meantime, we're just going to send people up to beat this uh, w uh b -b -b wildling invasion. Oh, I didn't know Gaston Gray was uh, not under us. Ah, uh, it's under Tyrosh. Fair enough, fair enough then. And I forgot this actually existed. Lonely Light. Yep, still technically under us. Alright, I think that little army should be able to handle everything. Sorry if I sound a little odd. My nose is a little stuffy. Yeah, honestly, he should probably be able to handle it himself, but eh. Anyway, what do we want to do? I kind of wanted to send uh, Emmerich off to go be a black brother, but unfortunately he's got one leg, so I can't do that. I could give him a cadet dynasty. Could try to get uh, more of uh, the marshals, but I don't know. We have Colin Stone here. He's got no bloodlines, but if we legitimize him, he might actually inherit the uh, Royce bloodline. Raymond is off potentially finding a wife. We'll have to see. And other than that... Hmm. I wonder if we should change Raymond's culture to uh, like crown lender it wouldn't actually do anything but thematically fits right but yeah we'll have to see anyway we're just gonna continue on and see if anything else interesting happens oh nope our kinsmen finally died we're gonna need a new marshal my friend deserves to be honored with the funeral he has served us all of his life we are basically the same age All the court of Gothica. Uh, vague promises. Spend enough for people to have enough food. And chief general. We have our, uh, our old squire Arlong. We could make him. We got Ingen. Uh... Hmm. Honestly, we should probably have at least... What's the difference between 30? Oh, yeah, we'll appoint Arlen right now. Yeah, organize the army, why not? And let the feasting commence! And I actually should check here. Raymond, you don't actually have a lover, do you? You do not. Alright. Hopefully you can find a good wife. Uh, Lady Elmeria Storm has used her attendants. Uh, claims that Prince Daemon Targaryen has sullied her reputation. Oh, uh, he is Prince Daemon the Mad. Son of Prince Aerys the Mad. Yeah. Why are they always all mad? Uh, arrested. Pay recompense. Yeah, pay recompense. I can't afford, uh... 
arrest one of my main bannermen just yet. Uh, Black Cells. I've recently been destroyed by a coastal storm. Uh, the people of the town. Oh, the Black Cells. Yeah, that's a city. Uh, for 60 gold. Yeah, forgive them. I, I sh guess I should rename that. I can't believe I made a, such a simple mistake. City of the Black Cells. Uh. What would be a. What would be a good city name? I don't know. We'll see. Uh, the funeral. We all can pause and read that. I've read that before. He was a man. <laughs> of course he was. Who was known to be most courageous and well possessing immense strength. And so it is done. Pause. If, unfortunately, Ingen did not have any other kids. Elisif did have a couple kids here, a couple Durandans. But other than that, his line seems to have ended. Alright. Well, that's unfortunate, but we're just going to continue on then. Hey! After many months sailing foreign seas, your son Prince Raven has returned from his tour. He apparently acquired a sturdy trading cog and used his knowledge of trading coin to ferry goods between the towns and cities. He's gained 100 prestige, 200 gold, lose 100 gold, gain 100 gold. Nice. Doesn't solve uh, the marriage issue, I suppose, but you know, whatevs. Uh, do we have anyone who's good? No, gods of Pentos. How about, say, uh, she's still the only genius, huh? Hmm. I don't know, I'm trying to find uh, a decent match for him, but... Since we're a Rilar, we can't really do anything like that. Oh, wait, no, is that the event with the uh, Lightbringer? That converts people? I don't know, we'll see. I'll, have to, I'm, I'll search for that event later. King's course is doing well. I'll be honest, I I don't know where King's Course is. <laughs> Castle of King's Course. Oh, for some reason we have something in Winterfell. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, I don't know where Raven Tree. It's a cool name, but where's uh, where be the Starks? Uh, bastards. Alright, William, we're gonna grant you a king's course. There we go. I, I don't care. I'm gonna grant it to whoever I want to grant it. Alright, we can get a potential two different uh, Targaryen ladies, because we have a favorites with them. So we either can get Princess Jahera, she is a genius, or we can go after uh, Prince, basically Princess Vesera. Same bloodlines, but she is 13, she's quick. So, huh. So I'm not sure which one we should go for, I'll be honest with ya. Who's more powerful? We have, uh, basically, the North. I think it's probably the best bet. Versus Dragonstone. Although the Dragonstone is more powerful. Huh. 
Yeah, I don't I don't know which one we should go for. I'll be I'll be completely honest with you on that one. I think we can hold off just a little bit. It's the sister to Lord Paramount Daggers Vasera. And then it's a daughter of the Prince of Dragonstone. Huh. But yeah, we'll we'll see. Uh, plus I we just won this war, so we are good on that one. Oh, we can send people off on new quests. Oh, that's actually really cool. Let's see. Uh, I guess we can make some wildfire. Sure, make some wildfire. Oh yeah, we can construct a laboratory. Uh, the way to book, we can construct a flagship. Uh, yeah, we'll just build everything now. So we could send uh, him off, but nah. We've sent our friend off, Lyle the White Raven, who would be uh, another good one to go off. Send. You know what, Edgar Bauer? Go on a quest. Glorious deed. I wish you the best of luck. Deep within the walls of Night's Blood. Yeah, I think that's how we get the uh, the best one. I think we also need to inqu acquire ingredients that can uh, rot. Oh, we have a full stockpile. What ingredients do we have? Okay, we have some that can rot. Ingredient kidney. Intestines antlers. Alright, I think we're good on that then. Uh, I guess we just go for the most expensive ones now. I think in order to have the best, you go for the most expensive. You need to have ingredients that can, you know, rot. And you have to make sure it's in, like, your castle. So we'll see how this goes. 150 gold, yep. We'll send you off to go do a quest. Oh, he has a... Oh! Blood of Sir Edgar Bauer. A knight of the King's Guard. Sir Edgar was a masterful warrior renowned for their skill in arms. Oh, I didn't know you got a bloodline for becoming a King's Guard. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. Let me... Let me just double check on that. Or maybe it's just that he's actually that honorable and all that. So with the sill. Lord Blood of Lord Commander. You think we should uh, legitimize him? I mean, he is, uh... Oh, we can't even legitimize him now. Fair enough. Oh, wow, but he doesn't have... Hmm. Maybe it's, uh... I should have sent him off on the quest. Alright. Maybe he could have came back as a, uh, as a formidable warrior, but oh well, maybe next time. Uh, can't do anything with that. We can build a new holding. Uh, let me check the great work. How is our, uh, yeah, there we go, Gothica. Hey, it's a level one. And all of this costs all of the money. We need uh, 7,000 basically. Uh, Great Harbor. Great Lighthouse. Magers Holdfest, the Royal Palace. Yeah. 
We're gonna need a lot of money to, you know, build stuff up. Hmm. What would be the next one we've gotten? Black Cells, Red Keep, Tower of the Hand. I mean, I'm assuming it would just, yeah, still just be a castle. Or we could try to just, you know, upgrade the holdings. Hmm. Uh, oh, let's just build another castle. What is that anyway now? And it won't tell me just yet. Oh, well, someone broke into my lab. I guess I can't really, uh... Do any of that, but now I think we can go after more ingredients. Well, it said some ingredients would be. Hmm. All right. Well, whatever then. Hey, the marriage has happened. It's all nice and fancy. Oh, these dragons have uh seem to have mated. All right. Uh, befitted. Oh. 400 gold, but there we go. An upgrade to uh, the black cells. And there we go. They have bedded, and it's fine. Our heir is now married. Everything is nice and good. We also have some, uh, wildfire. So, that's nice. Uh, great valuables. I still wish I knew how to do this, but I think this is just not working properly. But yeah, other than that. Oh, never mind. We got a state-of-the-art laboratory. We didn't get the best of the best, but it's still pretty nice. I don't know what's happening there. Allow the duel. If you guys have duels, you guys can go fight it out. You know, we can spend a little prestige here. Prove our formations. Why not? Oh, and hey, he's hatched a dragon? He's got a whip. A whip. Rovalgon's whip. Well, it's not in here, so... One sec, let's see if we can find you. Heartfire. Vogon. Uh, okay. 13, he's almost of uh, age. I should have been educating him. Oh, it's a lunatic too, that's gonna be lovely. He's crazed. Oh boy. Well, just have to see how that goes. Uh, you want to become master of ships? No. I mean, I suppose I should. Uh, he is literally only, like, this little lord, but... Mm. Ah, and he failed. Because he was already... He went to go train under Bravosi, but he was already a formidable fighter. Such a waste. And now... It's probably in one of these various... Uh, I can't remember the word modifier. That's it. Uh, exceptional education, cunning planner, protected from evil, promised godhood. I bet it will tell us as soon as we can, but let's just double check. Yeah, we'll just have to wait and see. Uh, personally praise them for saving no, people committing suicide. Uh, Darnold joins us. I'm, no, I have enough people, please, then. Thank you. Hey! Lord Valar Targaryen has informed you the new flagship for the Westerosi fleet is complete. The Drollmund is over. 700 oars and the huge sails blazing with the arms of House Marshal. 
Many hundreds of people gather to watch it be launched into the Sea of Gothica, and all say it is one of the largest ships they have ever seen. A magnificent ship, I must say. Hmm. We need to think of a name. Uh. Hmm. Ooh. I will select my own name. We shall name it the Black Storm. And we'll just say that uh, it's uh, painted black and everything. Oh, this should fall to the Lord of the Vale, who is our son in law. Speaking of which, how is our future Warden of the East? We also need a new Chief General. And we'll keep you. Because why not? Uh, train children. And I th think that's all good. Oh, wow. I don't have you doing anything. Oversee the realm. Hey, another one of these. Uh, stand down. Cool. I don't have time to deal with your shenaniganary. When is this being built? All right, this year. I know we have a. Uh, we shouldn't be actually holding this, but I still wish I could just convert this. You know. Uh. Just, yep. Yeah, it's a shame that I messed up on that one. But it's been a bit since I've actually played as a King of the Iron Throne, right? And Mafala has died. A small private funeral for her. Uh, Brella and Ellis Storm. Uh, we're gonna decline. And we'll see how that ends up reason with Bayard a uh, sea smoke has died a legend fades Gorgoson Thyriax green comet actually I want to heart fire third moon all right I just want to know what your picture is gonna be because that's uh, your grandparent there's your parent Dova our dragon not the best picture, in my opinion. I think this is probably the one I dislike the most for all the dragon portraits. I'm sorry. There's just a lot of cool dragon portraits, and that one is just, meh. I think, obviously, the the Caraxes default one is probably my favorite. Oh, there's another heart fire. Oh, boy. You're going to need to... Wait, no. Yeah, this is a different heart fire. Well, no, I think this one might be my least favorite, actually. Hmm. We'll just have to see what uh, it looks like, right? Oh, well, our daughter-in-law has come of age. A great eminence. Nice. That should be really helpful for uh, Raimi once he takes of uh, the throne. And I have my eye on trying to make a sword of the morning. We have a, a Dane here. Appoint me his guardian. Need a new squire anyway, right? Oh, hey, Dova and Sky Sailor have become a mating pair. Well, that's nice. How touching. Uh, Grand Tourney of Cider Hall. Of course, we go to the Grand Tourneys. Oh no, he's failed. Sothasil, what have you done? Something must be done about it. Uh, I'll allow the duel, I guess. Potema. Sothasil, you better go off and capture that dragon. I was actually really looking forward to you becoming a dragon knight. 
Hey, we have the portrait for uh, Heartfire. He's a lunatic, but still, it looks pretty baller. Not gonna lie, it looks better than Dova. Hopefully, uh, he gets tamed. Wait, no, he is tamed, right? Yeah, he is a tamed dragon. Never mind. It's all good there. Hey, we got a new dragon egg. I'm the adept dragon breeder. Oh, we have a wonderful a lover is pregnant. I don't know if we if I shown her off. She was a uh, someone we uh, made the queen of love and beauty. So we'll see how uh, that kid comes out. Uh, Raymond, you're a dragon rider. Oh, she's pregnant too. Nice. And do I want to give this egg to anyone in particular? Sothasil, you had your chance. Hmm. I don't know. Let me know your guys' thoughts on who I should give this egg to. In the meantime... I think it might be time to end the episode here. Current dragon egg, yep. Uh, hmm. Well, we'll see. How long have I been recording? All right, about twenty-six minutes or so. Oh no! Oh no! It froze. Ah! No! Don't tell me. Yep. The game. It's like cr kind of crashing right now. Well, that's unfortunate. All right, keep an eye on the date. It might change by next episode. We'll see. It should have just did an autosave, so I don't think we'll lose much. Hopefully, we still have the dragon egg. But yeah, that's unfortunate. It seems to be happening more and more often. So I think next episode might be the last episode. And I think I have a good plan on how to end it. So. Let me know your guys' thoughts, though, for this, and, uh, yeah. You guys might not see another episode of this for an extra week, as I will actually be on vacation in a couple days. So, I don't know if I'll be able to pre-record anything, but if I can, well, there we go. If not, well, sorry. I'll post a, like, thing on the community page as well, just letting people know on that one. But, yeah, other than that, uh, go check out the community page. Uh, I think I still have the question I have for Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines. You guys want to ask or answer anything like that, go right ahead. I'll check out everything else on the page, or channel, I should say. And, yeah. Hope you all enjoyed. Leave any uh, suggestions, comments, and everything down below, and leave a like if you like, leave a dislike if you dislike, but tell me why, and I shall see you all later.